Hello everyone, welcome back to the Fat Hipster channel. It's me, John, and today I'm going to be reviewing a product from Burger King. If you've seen my latest videos, I've been reviewing a couple chicken sandwiches lately, and that trend will continue today. Today's sandwich is going to be the Italian Royal Crispy Chicken. Um, if you don't know, <clears throat> recently Burger King has switched from their chicken to their Royal Chicken Sandwich. Uh, I believe it's a cost-cutting thing. Uh, the chickens were rather expensive uh, compared to other chicken sandwiches and sandwiches in general on the uh, Burger King menu. So I think after an initial uh, burst of sales, it probably went down a little bit. So it probably went down to like their typical chicken sandwich sales numbers. Uh, so in order to save money, I think they, they chose a smaller, cheaper uh, piece of chicken and less premium ingredients like buns and stuff. But this is the Italian version of that sandwich. It has marinara sauce, a slice of mozzarella cheese, and more marinara sauce. This is different than the Wendy's uh, new Italian chicken sandwich that has a whole patty of fried mozzarella cheese on it, which kind of resembles mozzarella sticks. Which is what I have here. I got a four piece, which actually came as two, a crumpled looking one, and then two halves, which looked like they got smushed. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try it by itself, but then I'm gonna put some of these mozzarella sticks on top of it just for fun. Here we go. It's a good chicken sandwich. It has um, more marinara sauce, I think, than the Wendy's one did. Uh, it's less overall dry feeling in my mouth. The mozzarella cheese itself doesn't have a ton of flavor. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take these smushed halves. I'm going to put it just where my next couple bites would be on the sandwich. So, there, it kind of looks like that. I have the two mozzarella sticks there. And this part is just for fun. It's really not adding much to this experience. But really, burning mozzarella sticks in general are kind of bland. Yeah. The breading doesn't really have any seasonings on it. Just kind of one one note, one color. I think you really have to depend on this brown looking marinara sauce. Yeah, the marinara sauce, it adds all the seasonings. It has that acidicness that a tomato sauce would have so I would not put Burger King mozzarella sticks on top of their chicken sandwich
it's a decent chicken sandwich for what it is. The marinara, so marinara sauce is good. The chicken itself is, it's not a, it's not a chicken nugget kind of consistency, like a McDonald's McChicken patty, or even the Burger King, is it called the classic chicken? The one that's like oval, oblong shaped. It's not reformed. It is like a whole piece of chicken. It's just not as big as the chicken. It's not hand breaded like the chicken. It's probably just a frozen patty. Comparing it to the Wendy's one, it is it is a, a moister sandwich. The cheese and the sauce on here actually like have a fluidity to them. It is it's missing the same flavor characteristics that the Wendy's one had. The Wendy's one had a good chicken flavor. A decent tomato sauce flavor and the fried cheese flavor uh, as well as like a sharp provolone slice which all came together to make a uh, relatively enjoyable experience this one not as enjoyable I'll give it a single thumbs up The mozzarella sticks, I give it a no thumbs up. I'm not going to give them any thumbs down, but they're kind of bland. With the sauce, they're pretty good. But that's about it. They're, they're carriers of sauce. Um, the current uh, thing they have going on for this is a $7 small meal combo seven dollars you get that chicken sandwich you get a small drink you get a small order of fries as well also if you order on the app every time you order one of these italian crispy chicken sandwiches once per day uh you're entered into a a contest for like a trip to italy or something um there's no purchase necessary every day you have a free entry just by like looking at some basic Italian information about a city in Italy. I think it was like two sentences long. You can just read it. You just have to click the button that opens the information. Um, and then you also have to have a Burger King app account that saves your information there that you actually looked at it. Um, you also have to order it off the app for it to register your bonus entry. I believe it's like a week long, so you get like seven entries. Plus, if you order a sandwich every day, you can get another seven entries, so a total of 14 entries into it. Um, I don't think the odds are going to change too much if you buy something or not. But uh, it is there if that's something you're interested in. Um, anyway, I have a second item that I'm going to review, but it's interestingly enough that I'm not going to add it here as a bonus thing. Excuse me, I'm going to record it as its own review um, just because I wasn't planning on doing it, it kind of came as a surprise to me while I was in the drive-thru um, it's actually something that's not even advertised on the roll app or the website so I'm thinking this is a test run uh, so I want to get that out separately and have the title as what it is um, so that people looking for that specifically will get that and not have to watch this whole video beforehand Anyway, appreciate you watching. Give it a like. Subscribe to the channel. We'll see you on that next video, uh, which should come out maybe a day or two later. Anyway, bye. See you later.